our sensory bags. They have been made with hair gel and water, um, as well as various items inside, such as sequins and googly eyes and beads. Um, they've been reinforced along the edges with duct tape um, to help prevent it from leaking. Um, they are in plastic bags, so they're easy to clean with disinfectant or with soap and water. Um, they are great to use to move objects around. Um, they can be used to categorize um, the various objects into a corner. Um, they can also be used to practice writing numbers and letters. Um, so a time to use them um, could be in the classroom if you've got a student who is trying to learn to write letters or numbers and is having a harder time sitting still. Um, another time that they can be used um, would be to help introduce uh, a student to different textures um, because they've got the gel and they have the different items in there. Um, and so it's a great way to um, practice feeling different textures. Um, they are made with um, plastic bags, so they're not indestructible. So um, use caution when um, pushing the items to the edge. Um, they're fairly sturdy, but um, they could be punctured by the items inside if used too aggressively. Thanks, hope you enjoy. Uh -huh.